YouTube, this is Hackstar1, and today I'm going to reviewing, going to be reviewing the Nerf Raider. Okay, first of all, let's go over the bits and bads. Um, the good thing is, um, let's see. Uh, the stock is removable. Um, also, use the pump. Um, you don't have to pull the trigger back very far. And it's got two modes of firing. You, the first mode is you just pump it and fire. And the second mode is you hold on the trigger. keeps firing it. Okay, um the it's it's pretty comfortable in your hands. But um, a bad thing is the stock. It well it it is adjustable. Yeah. You don't have to press the button to pull it out more. But the, okay, sorry about that. My memory card was full. Um yeah, this, like I was saying, the stock, it is not very comfortable. Like this, this is not very comfortable. But, I prefer it without the stock, like this. Because you can move it around faster, and I think it's just better. It's tinier. And here is the drum mag. Yeah. I already got it full. It may look like it has some empty spots here. But it will hold, I think, one more extra dart. See? One more dart other than, or two more darts than 35. But I prefer not to do that because I do not want to break it. And there's no wheel here in case a dart gets jammed in there. Yeah, and another bad thing is, load this thing in, I think they should have put the magwell on the bottom, because this kind of weighs it, the drum mag kind of weighs it down, but if, if you use a regular clip, it, I think it would be better. If you just got made like a double clip. Oh, and it also has a unjamming door. You just slide it. But another bad thing is you cannot access it when the bolt is forward. Like that. Now you cannot access it. It does not go forward or back, it does not go back. I also think that is a little hard to get the mag the um big drum mag out when it's inside. It's when they put the the clip release right here. It's a little uncomfortable. Another bad thing is it does not come with any type of sight. But it does have two tactical rails. And I don't know if they forgot to on mine, but it doesn't have the digital camera on it. You c it just has the, you can see the little spots where it would be, but it's, it's just blue. It's the same color as the gun. So I thought that was a little gay. Yeah. But, it actually is pretty good. Yeah. So, on to the ranks. Wait, no, that's copying. Uh, that's copying, uh, 
So yeah, Cox 97. Okay, um... Frank time, bye-bye. Okay, this is the range test for the, um, Nerf Raider. And holding it straight, three, oh, the edge of that wall where the mirror is, that's 25 feet. Three, two, one, firing. I saw where it landed. It landed about here first. Right here. So that's 25 feet. This is probably mm, 18 and a half feet. Okay, now we need to test it without the stock. Okay. Okay, no. Okay. Hold this is without the stock. Holding it straight. Three, two, one, button. That made it all the way to the wall. So that's twenty five feet. So twenty five plus eighteen is let's see, thirty five plus eight is forty three. Forty three divided by two is around 21 feet, 21 and a half feet, so not too bad, not too bad, okay.